When I was a child, I had one dream. To be able to hit clay pigeons with a crossbow in the dark at 300 yards while riding on the back of a beautiful Pegasus. Anyway, my mom told me, Kristen, if you want to have that kind of hyper-acute night vision, you've got to eat your carrots. But do carrots really give you better eyesight? Was my mom really just lying to me? Carrots are packed full of a nutrient called beta-carotene, which is kind of like a natural dye for fruits and vegetables. Plants use beta-carotene in their bodies as a pigment that gives them a yellow-orange color. But when you eat foods containing this natural pigment, like sweet potatoes, spinach, or carrots, the beta-carotene gets absorbed by your intestinal wall and converted into vitamin A. So here's the true part of the myth. If you want to maintain normal eye health, you've got to get enough vitamin A, and carrots are a perfectly good source. In regions where people don't get much vitamin A in their diets, vision problems are rampant. Without vitamin A, the photoreceptors in your eyes start to deteriorate, and your corneas can actually vanish. But if you don't have a vitamin A deficiency and your vision is already healthy, stuffing your face with carrots or any other source of the vitamin won't lead to any superhuman eyeball powers. So where did we get the idea that carrots do to your eyes what spinach does to Popeye's forearms? During World War II, the UK was subjected to Axis air raids when the German Luftwaffe would strike at British cities in the night. From 1939 onward, British pilots had access to a technology called onboard airborne interception radar to help them spot enemy planes from a great distance. But the UK Ministry of Food launched a propaganda campaign claiming that its fighter pilots could pick out enemy aircraft in the dark because they honed their eyes with carrots. German blockades meant that many goods, like sugar, had to be rationed, and the UK government was encouraging its citizens to turn to sugar substitutes. For example, carrots, which were plentiful even during the war and could be used as a sweetener in foods like carrot pudding and carrot fudge, and even as a substitute for meat in the infamous Woolton pie. Mmm. Did you hear the carrot super sight myth when you were growing up like I did? What's your favorite way to use carrots in the kitchen? And have you ever tasted Woolton pie? Leave a comment to let us know. And if you want to learn more strange stories that we've baked up about food traditions, like why bacon is a breakfast food, while you're here, subscribe to all of it. It's called Brain Stuff.